Hello, welcome back to my channel. I want to go on a hike today, so I figured I'd take you guys with me. I'm going to be riding there, so I'm about to gear up and head out. Hello, I am riding solo today and I thought I would take you guys with me on this hike. I do have my mic set up and connected to my Ace Pro on my helmet, so I will be including some of that audio, but I wanted to record a little intro. So thanks for watching and I hope you guys like the video. I also, if you can see, have a ridiculous setup right now, camera setup, the Ace Pro on my helmet with the mic adapter so I can speak into it and hopefully I have audio this time and it's not completely silent like the last time. Um, and then I have the Insta360 X3 and the X4, kind of side by side. I want to test the quality difference because I posted a video with the X4 and the fact that it can do 8K and some people were like, oh, I didn't see a difference between this and the X3 that I have. So I'm actually curious and I might as well since I have all these crazy cameras. And I don't mean for this to be just like me flaunting my stuff. I'm very grateful and fortunate with that partnership. Um, and these are honest reviews. Like I'm just showing y'all how I'm feeling about it. I'll let you know if it actually is, there is a difference between these cameras and what are the upgrades. But I must say, out of all the cameras that I have, the Ace Pro is probably my favorite. It doesn't have the 360 capabilities that these two in front here have. Um, where you can edit in 360 view and you know all that kind of stuff but quality the fact that it's super easy to edit i feel like i missed the turn wait no i think it's coming up i kind of forget where this hike is oh wait yeah it's coming up it's coming up summer is here i'm wondering if anyone's excited about that if anyone had to hide away their motorcycle for winter and they're ready to take it out so that they can start riding again. Let me know if that's any of you guys and what you guys do in the meantime. Do you miss riding? Are you like okay with having that big break? Do you still try to go out and ride even when it's crazy weather? I'm curious. All right, we gotta do something fancy to get to this hike. Gotta do a little wrap around. Whee! And this roundabout. Get visitors on the left lane. Okay, that's me. I'm kind of nervous though because I think this gate up here is like at an incline and I have to show my ID. And I don't know, like, I don't want the bike to fall backwards as I'm trying to show them my ID. Whatever, it's fine figure it out. I'm curious to know if the majority of my viewers are people that ride motorcycles or if it's people like the recurring viewers if it's people that are interested in learning how to ride. I feel like I have a good healthy mix maybe I'm not sure. Okay it's not that bad not that bad of an incline I think I don't know why I was thinking it was like much more. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Hey, yes okay Thank you. Oops, I'm not allowed to film. Uh-oh. Well, shall we keep this between you and me? I won't film too much on the road. I kind of forgot the way up though, so uh, we'll see. I think you just follow this road. I totally stuffed that ticket in my jacket though. I did not put that back in the pocket, so I hope it doesn't fall or get sweaty. <laughs> wow, this is beautiful. Oh my gosh. Don't go, don't go. Okay, lady, holy sh- I forgot how steep this road is. And how loud my bike must be through this neighborhood. Okay, yeah, that was easy. Just follow this road. Into the forest we go. Wow. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Is that not the most beautiful thing you've ever seen? 
well, maybe not the most beautiful, one of the coolest, okay, I don't know what I'm saying. into the stall like a good biker does go into neutral yes so I can easily get out well look at that we have arrived at our destination I'm gonna be testing out some new hiking shoes oh gotta turn off these cameras yeah, I'm testing out some hiking shoes that I have with me. I'm gonna go put those on and see if I should return them or not. I'm trying to find some really good hiking shoes that have a lot of good grip on them because all the hiking shoes that I've used previously have zero grip on them. They're kind of more like running shoes. I don't know what I was thinking, but uh, yeah. So I'm gonna test these out because I like to go hiking on ridges and things, you know, but I need shoes that'll keep up with me. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna take off my gear and stuff and then I'll meet you guys on the hike. Oh crap, I did lose the paper. I was looking for it. Oh my gosh. I have to put this on my bike. Put it right in center. I don't want it to fly away. I'll figure this out. In case anyone's curious, here are the shoes. I'm gonna test them out. Whoa. See how they do. I just passed that group with the remote control monster truck. What a fun way to spend the day, you know? Just driving some remote control monster trucks through a crazy cool hike. Now we're getting to a good lookout spot. This ridge is pretty cool. Ooh, epic shot through the... I don't know what I'm doing. Dang, my battery's almost low on this. That's the one thing about the Ace Pro is the battery life is not that long, surprisingly. And I don't know why. we have it with me, I'm going to record some footage with the X4 camera in 8K. See how that looks. I don't want to see myself in 8K, but I want y'all to see the view. Oh my gosh. I'm going to, I think this hiking trail leads all the way into those ridges. And I believe there's like steps at the end, I think. Yes, this is how I test my shoes to see if they're good. Oh, maybe I shouldn't be doing this as I'm holding like a really expensive camera. <laughs> and maybe I shouldn't go all the way up because how am I going to get down? These shoes are great. They're doing their job. And I feel comfortable and confident that I can take these on much crazier hikes. Wow, they have great grip. These are actually, I think, mountain running shoes, which I would consider being the same as mountain hiking shoes. Look at this. I really like the differences in the terrain. One minute you're kind of just like out on an open ledge. Oh, look at these. Beautiful. <laughs> um, one second you're in an open range and now you're in... Whoa, do you hear that? Now you're in the forest. That hut is kind of scary. Do you see that? Let's check it out. I feel like I'm intruding on something. I don't know. All I know is I'm gonna get the F out of here. This continues all the way up that trail. And then you can even get to those ones way back there, I think. It just keeps going. I'm almost done with the hike now. Not bad. Well, let's head back down my favorite part. Because then you get to see the beautiful view. They're doing a barbecue over there. That looks so fun. It'd be so cool to live in this area. Would it though? I wonder how much they got to pay. And Oh, this is going to be interesting. 
going down a very steep road. Ooh, wow, oh my gosh, okay, I'm getting speed. Some engine braking is happening. There's a gated community within a gated community. What kind of gateception is that? Whee! I don't think I've been on this road when the waves were like going. Oh my gosh. See, this is not good. I'm getting too distracted by the waves. <laughs> focus. Thank you, you too. Finally, I bought a tinted visor. I was putting it off for the longest time because I thought I was going to get a new helmet, but I'm still deciding what helmet I want to get. So in the meantime, I decided to just get myself a tinted visor for this helmet. I want to thank you guys so much for joining me on my hike. I hope you guys enjoyed the scenic views and hanging out with me. Just let me know what other stuff you guys want to see and I'll see you guys in the next one.